Or with Mustang head soccer coach T.J. Buchholz following the Mustangs' uh, three nothing win over the University of Sioux Falls on Friday night. And coach, what a great way to to start the conference season! Just a complete effort by your squad today, uh, offensively and uh, defensively. You made uh, a couple of saves when you had to when the game was really close. But yeah. uh, overall, just a, a very good way to win to start the conference season. Yeah, I mean uh, Sioux Falls is a very good team. Uh, you know, we knew they were going to come in and be organized, and I thought at times they broke us down uh, in a way that gave us fits. Uh, uh, number 19 was uh, excellent for them, Maria. Um, but I, I thought we, you know, kind of played a, a better game overall, complete uh, game defensively. We played a little bit better this game. Uh, offensively, I felt like we had a lot of chances. Um, it was great to get three more. Again, it's that's kind of the the theme for us. It looks like every time we've we've scored three goals uh, in each of our three games. So yeah, it's a good way to start. Uh, the crowd was great. It was uh, awesome to have that uh, for our for our girls. Well, obviously the score three nothing and uh, the three stands out. But I tell you what. I thought a big, pl- uh, big play uh, in the match. The Mustangs up one nothing late yeah. in the first half, and a huge save by Sonia Smith. And sometimes that gets overlooked, but that was a huge play in the match. Yeah, Sonia just continually. We, we tell her we need her to make that one or two saves a game that are big, and and she does that every time. And uh, definitely, and, and even in the second half, they had a great opportunity that uh, Sonia stopped as well. So, I mean, it, it's nice to have with the young defensive line that is in front of her. Um, you know, at times if they get broken down, your keeper Sonia makes you know. Pay, you know, helps them out. So, and how about uh, on the offensive side? You put 19 shots. Uh, you know, many on goal. What was the the, the key tonight for your offense to get so many uh, scoring chances? Uh, I think we stretched them out. I think our uh, we did a good job of kind of keeping our width. And when our girls got the ball, they were able to to kind of go at their defenders and get down to that inline and, and get good services into the 18. Um, you know, for our girls, uh, I think we had some some good opportunities. Their keeper had a phenomenal game. I mean, she made some unbelievable saves. Came off her line. And made some big, uh, you know, big saves for their team. So I, I was pretty impressed with our team. Uh, you know, we didn't maybe have, um, you know, we got a penalty kick at the end, but I think a lot of our our attempts that we had were good looks on goal. And of course, now you you got some time off, but now head on the road. Uh, you know, conference play is always tough, and now we get to see with the team with a couple of big road matches coming up. Yeah, I mean, uh, we got to go to North Dakota next weekend to play uh, two very good teams, Mary and Minot. Uh, they both are getting great results right now. Um, they're probably in that top end of our conference. Uh, so it's going to be a big test. We're a young team. Uh, we've got to go, you know, several hours on the road for next weekend uh, to play on the road against the uh, two quality teams. Um, but you know, I think uh, the three wins that we have is building our confidence, and I'm hoping we can take that into next weekend uh, and find more success. All right, great job, Coach. Three and zero. Congrats, and good luck next week. Great, thanks, Kelly.